previously on Legacy SMP. Yeah. We're all magnetized by each other. So. I guess if I stand up here, you yeah. can squeeze in. <laughs> here it goes. <laughs> Ten seconds. <laughs> okay, are, are we ready? Are you ready for this? All right. Yeah, okay, the last head. Let's go. Okay, here we go. The last head is going yeah. down. Momentous occasion. Well done, teams. Yink. Here we go. Yoink. Hey. Oh. That's wait. a lot of stuff. What? Uh, nice. I didn't, I didn't get anything. Really? Oh, no. wait, I didn't get wait, it. Where's the, the trophy? What? I didn't get it. What? what? Oh, there we go. Oh, there, there we go. go. Oh, you fools, what's that? Wait, what? What's going wait, what? on? What is that? I need trophies. Bring the house of Withers into this sport. You what? fools! What does that mean? Bring we didn't even get the what achievement. The... Wait, what? What's happening? What's happening? Wait, we didn't get you What fools? the heck? What's this? What's going on? What are these names? What is going uh, on? Do I need to... I haven't I'm lost scared. the mobs yet. Um... Hold me closer. Um, oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. You fools, these demons are my soul composition. Everything you have done here has enabled our arrival. Focusing the power of the rift gave us a bridge to this world. Coward, Legates. This one shall be power. Let's like, like, get out of here. I mean, this is let's, let's go. Let's go. Get out of here. Go, 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 go. Fly, fly, fly. Oh, no. Fly away. Face the ball. Quick. Oh, I'm stuck. Go, go, go. I'm go. Okay. I'm still looking back. Quick, quick, quick. Oh, Through the portal. Get out of here. All over the place. Wait, where'd the portal go? Over here. Okay, over okay. here. Quick, Pearly, quick. Free, free, free. Oh my god, there's a creeper. I'm going. There's so many mobs here. Oh, I see it. Okay. Hello. Get oh gosh, there's a creeper here. right next to the floor. Okay. <laughs> what okay, just get, happened? Get we officially have a winner. Uh, I, I think. I, I didn't get it. <laughs> Don't go back there, okay? I didn't yeah, get it. We want to avoid that area for a while. That's so Could weird. Be bad. Oh yeah, well, we can fix advancements later, I guess. But I don't know how to fix that problem. <laughs> <laughs> what are we going to do about that? I think, oh, oh let's, let's, let's get out of here. So we got multiple problems on our hands. Yeah, we got... Yeah, um, multiple wither problems. Literally. We got, was there five? I think there was five withers there, I think, I think was there it? was five of them, right? Yeah. yeah. And they seemed not very happy with us. <laughs> that was oh. really scary. Okay, well, let's, let's not go back there. Um... But listen, I was thinking we about. We kind of want the achievement, though. <laughs> I think, well, I think, yeah, I'm not quite sure what happened there, but we've basically got that achievement between us. So the, the advancement race is over, and it's basically a draw, then, right, between the two teams. So yeah, yeah. I suppose so. So it's a tie. So remember, Yay! remember, well, remember, we kind of had that little thing where you know the losing team would do the chores of the other. How about we have a bit of fun mm -hmm. with that, and we still do that, so we'll do your chores and you could do ours, and I guess we have to dress up as well. French maid costume. Yes. Okay. Yeah. I'm okay with cool. that. Uh, we can you do remember it that one. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I yeah. need to have my bar finished immediately. <laughs> <laughs> oh, don't worry, I'm going to give you a good old list, don't you worry about that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Oh, okay. oh yes, okay. Pearl. I forgot oh, yes. about my chores. Okay. Well, I'm Whatever. still going in my event, so I'm going to just catch up to you guys eventually. She's going to be a little busy. Yeah, well, that, well, the whole thing on this server is we all help each other anyway, so we can all help make yeah. sure whoever well, wants so to get all the advancements, we'll, we'll, we'll make sure everyone gets it. That's true. Okay. As it turns out, the withering energy must have affected the advancements race, and it caused a little bit of an issue getting the advancement, but it's been a little bit delayed, and here it is. We got it. Congratulations. You have completed the Blazing Cave Adventure Pack. Yeah, Advancement Pack. We've done it. We got all of the advancements and the advancement race is now over. And there we have it. Confirmation on the leaderboard that myself, Poppy and uh, Sly Slime have got the full 817 uh, advancements. We're all tied for equal first. You can see that. And the little uh, emoji there means that we have completed it. And uh, yeah, we also keep the timestamp of when we when we did that. So we've made that all the same because we, we should have all got those advancements at the same time. But there was a little, a little bug in the system, but uh, that's all resolved now. So it's all good. And so a deal is a deal. We need to do our chores. So Poppy has given us this book that's got a bunch of tasks in it. We'll read that in a second. But before we can do that, we have to get changed. So the deal was that uh, Team LL would be dressed up as French maids, believe it or not. <laughs> and Team PP are going to be dressed as clowns to do their, do their chores. So I guess before we read that, we need to uh, enter the changing room right here and, and get changed. Oh, dear. OK, so let's get rid of these, these red shoes that we wear. Let's get rid of our shirt. And we'll get rid of our trousers 
there we go so we should be should be all good now now I've just got to get onto my get my new kit on okay i think i'm ready let's uh open this door and let's have a look what do we look like as a french maid what do you think of logical maid boy <laughs> not too bad look at this all the way around very nice indeed we are ready ready now to do do our chores dear logic congratulations on getting to do my chores that's a great honor and i hope you'll be properly dressed for the occasion please read the following list of chores okay let's check this out list of chores number one finish the barn okay we'll check that out in a second make me a statue okay piston door entrance to the withered tavern more proof spawn area okay <laughs> take care of my llamas oh yeah i can take care of them all right don't you worry about that find me several cats bring to my base platonic love pop tart cats p.s congratulations on the advancements okay that is our list of chores that we need to perform and i suppose we should meet up with pop we'll go and check out the barn and i think i need to prepare a list of chores for her to do and here are the tasks that i have uh, created for team pp so down here we've got uh, improve world spawn island with a nice build so far that's just a, a small island uh, with a portal slapped on it so that if we could improve that that would be great fully staffed the casino so there's a bunch of places in the casino that we need some villagers to be staffed so we need four villagers uh, to do that i can show them where that is uh, when they get to it I dig out a large area underneath main storage so that is uh, to hold the news multi-item system we're going to be building in there and i'll help them dig that out i don't not sure how much space we'll need just yet but i'll work that out and uh, yeah help them with that get me as many shulker shells as you can again that is for the, the new storage system we're going to have shulker box loaders and whatnot in there so we'll need a whole bunch of shulker shells uh make me a statue slightly better than the one i make you <laughs> that's nice and the last one of course is when you see me online greet me as the one true king very simple there we go six tasks i'm sure the team pp will be good with that so let's go over to the barn meet up with poppy and see what she thinks poppy oh, logic. Hi, i'm here i'm inside the barn i'm inside your beautiful i'm well. so excited to see you okay i'm i want to see you too <laughs> come here i want to see it wait to see your lovely outfit <laughs> where it's, are you my outfit oh, is definitely the... where's your barn how'd you get in here <laughs> I don't know, where's the entrance to this thing? Okay, there we go. <gasps> oh, geez, look at that. Oh, wow. <laughs> very so nice. So cute, so cute. I think, do you like mine? I do like yours, very nice. I think I, uh, I think- cuter. I think I'll still win the, the cutest award. No, 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 I'm, I'm definitely this. cuter. You're, I'm definitely no way, cuter. No way, I'm definitely the cutest. Hey, we this. both have bow ties now. <laughs> No, it's super ties, cool. It looks super cool. My All right. bow tie is extra fancy. Yes. <laughs> Let me take my wings off as well, so you get the full, the full effect. Oh, you there get the three, we go. The full three sixty. Look at that. Wow. Beautiful. Beautiful. Wow. Super cute. Your stocking's <laughs> falling down a little bit, but that's okay. you'll get that's it together. Right. That's it. It's all, it, yeah. all, all, all part of the style, you know. Anyway, I've got to. Uh, I've come here for a reason. So obviously, fixing up this barn was on your list. So I'm going to take care of this. I've seen you put some. Is it? Did you put some TNT down here? Were you kind of preempting what might happen? Well, Logic, you know what? You kind of saying things, talking poorly about the barn. So I, I was just getting frustrated, and I was like, you know what? We'll just blow this place up. No, no, no it's all good. No, I think, I think I can rescue it. I've, I've, I've got some ideas. So don't worry about that. Or the, we'll, we'll definitely think, fix things up. I mean, we've got to make this thing a bit more productive. I think all these chests need to be dealt with. Yeah, there's a, there, there's some stuff we can do here. But listen, I've got your list of tasks. So do you want to... I've been waiting. Okay, I can't wait. So these, these are Team PP tasks, so you can share those with uh, with Pearl as well. So what, what do you think? Let's see. To Team PP, congrats on getting all the advancement. As agreed, here are my list of tasks. Improve World Spawn Island with a nice build. Okay. You can do that. <laughs> <laughs> Fully staff the casino with villagers. Are you kidding me? No. I have to deal with villagers? Yeah. Ugh. All yeah, right. so you need four of those. I can show you where, where they go uh, a bit later. These on. are supposed to be easy tasks. You got way easier tasks from me. <laughs> Dig out a large area under main storage for the new system. Mm -hmm. Okay, mm -hmm. I can do that. Get me as many shulker shells as you can. Are you? <laughs> You're asking for a lot. I didn't specify an amount. Just, just, just as many as you can. So whatever you feel okay, is, which uh, is, is like appropriate. Maybe zero. <laughs> No. <laughs> okay, maybe one. Make me a statue slightly better than the one I made. <laughs> With the French maid outfit on, right? Of course, yes. Okay. When you see me online, greet me as the one true... 
I can't with that. Is not that's a it. chore. That's, that's the task. No. That is the official tasks that cannot be cannot be uh, escaped. Okay, good. So I'm glad you got the well, agreement. I'm going, so I'm the, going to extend my chore list. Okay. No, you can't extend. What is, what is this? It's not a never-ending list am. forever. <laughs> There's going to be amendments. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't read that in the small print. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Okay, well, all right. Fair. So I think um, I think I definitely win the, the cutest award. So uh, we can no, agree on can. that. So that's all good. So let me know in the comments what you think. Who's the cutest? Obviously me. Very good. All right, so I'm going to uh, get some plans together for this place. And then, yeah, once it's all done up, I'll bring you over and see what you think. So no TNT then? We're, nope. not, ex we're not blowing uh, it up? Not yet. I'll, I'll see what I can do. Not yet. Okay. Well, but I'm not ruling it out. <laughs> all right. All right, and I'll get I'll get ready with your uh, chores. Okay. And see what all I right. can do. Off you go, uh, then. The one, the one true king. Okay, very oh. good. I mean, if, if if that's too much of a muscle, you could just call me Your Majesty. That's fine as well. Oh no 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 no. <laughs> okay, right, go on and off you go. Go and do some go and do some work. Chop chop. All right, all right, all right, all right. <laughs> okay, see you later. So here's a statue that's been around, and look at this. What's going on here? Got a head now, and a name as well. Hmm, very interesting. We're back at base, still looking super cute. And look at that, there is another statue with looks like a different head. We'll check that out in a second. But before we do that, I want to show you what I've got. So I've uh, created a little to-do list. So this is based on uh, the book from Poppy. So I've put Poppy's book down here, but then just to keep it nice and straightforward, I've uh, got the signs for all the different things. Uh, the barn we're going to uh, pick up in a second. And yeah, we've got all the other bits and pieces over there in particular taking care of, uh, of her llamas. Yeah, we'll do that, no worries. And we've got some other projects. So the main storage for the server, we'll work on that over the next few weeks. And then uh, some other farms and bits and pieces. And of course, last of all, find a way to deal with those withers. Not quite sure how we're gonna deal with them, but uh, yeah, that's what we're gonna do. So I've been in a creative world and I've done uh, some uh, some designing for the new barn and I've got all the materials right here. We've got a bunch of redstone and materials and whatnot in here. So yeah, we're ready to go on that front. And over here, this is another statue, another Wither Commander, a Cat Keepers. Hmm, very suspicious. And another one, this time for Kalsvi. Shiny Mega Altaria. Hmm, this is getting very fishy indeed. And here we have the infamous Emma Owl Lady. Hmm, this is the barn in its current state. Not a very good state, as you can see. Things of looks like Poppy has exploded some of the TNT. And um, yeah, looking at this now and looking at the design I've come up with, I think the whole thing has to go, <laughs> including the sheep. They all need to be moved. So I'll keep the sheep around. Um, I'll probably put them into a pen uh, somewhere over there out of the way. But basically this whole area has got to come down. We need to flatten the area out a bit more. We'll do some terraforming a little bit later on. There's lots of kind of explosions all over the place and the ground doesn't look all that great, but uh, we'll deal with that later on. But uh, yeah, the first thing is to clear this area up and get ready for the build. And with that, the barn is no more. You can see we've got all the sheep together over there in a little pen. And I've uh, tried to terraform the area a little bit, just some basic stuff here, trying to get rid of all the obvious TNT holes and the exposed stonework we had and things like that. So it kind of looks natural-ish, I suppose, but we can we can do, do some more stuff with that a bit later on. And this is the size of the barn itself. So we've got the out, outside here with the, the cobblestone slabs. And inside here, this is where the, uh, the sheep are going to be. We're going to have eight along this side. And then another eight along this side for the for the uh, full 16 colors. And then each sheep's going to have a uh, chest underneath it. So we don't have to rummage around all the chests looking for the color we want. We can just go to the sheep and uh, yeah, pick it up from there. So I think the first thing I'm going to do is probably build one or two modules of the sheep. First of all, over here, get a couple in, make sure it's all working, that kind of stuff, and then build up all of the rest of them. And then once we've done that, we'll finish the uh, the outside barn itself. And uh, yeah, I spent a bit of time in creative. I think it looks okay. Um, Poppy's already seen it on our creative server. She's uh, giving it the uh, the thumbs up, the seal of approval. So I think the next thing is to, yeah, get to work on building up the first of these uh, these pods to hold the sheep. And the first two sheep are in. The pink, there we go, just saw that one get, uh, get sheared. The pink and the magenta are in. And yeah, this is uh, yeah pretty easy to do, actually. So underneath, we're going to have uh, the, the chest per, per sheep. So all the colors are going to stay together. So nice and easy to get the wall that you need. And yeah, color-coded the glass that uh, surrounds uh, surround the sheep. And yeah, under uh, over here, 
not pretty similar to what uh, what Pop had before. Uh, instead of a minecart going across, we just have one hopper minecart uh, per each sheep. That goes into the into the hoppers underneath. And then what we've got above that is we've got uh, obviously the sheep as before. We've got the uh, the observer looking at the the, the block that the sheep uh, eats. So that will send a signal to this block powers it powering that. If I hop up here just to show you the rest, we've got uh, this redstone dust will then power this observer looks at that powers this uh, this uh, ice here, which then powers the uh, uh, powers the note block so we get a little chime whenever whenever the the dirt changes the uh, this observer sees that powers the dispenser there causal connectivity so that will shear the sheep from from above and then above that we've got i go up a bit further we've got a hopper there that is to feed more shears into the system so we're going to have uh, some rails that go all the way around and a hopper minecart that that gets sent off uh, every now and again to uh, yeah to make sure that all of the uh, all the dispensers are filled with shears so we should have uh, sheep I said sheep. We should have wool for days. I was going to say sheep for days. We should have wool for days uh, after all of that. So if we need to add more storage, we can do that as well. Uh, we've got some options later on, but I think a free double chest for the time being uh, is uh, miles more than we had before. I think we just had like maybe six chests in total. So now we're going to have three per sheep. So that is uh, pretty cool. So it's getting dark. <laughs> we're not sleeping at the moment because we want to get uh, thunderstorms for Pearl so she can get uh, some skeleton horses to finish up the advancements that she needs. So now just got to do another 14 of these <laughs> yeah, and get the rest of the sheep in. And after a bit more building and a bit of sheep wrangling, we have got the farm finished up. We still need to add uh, the building on the outside, but we'll do that next. But yeah, just wanted to give you a quick heads up and a quick progress report on how the barn, the barn renovations are going. And you can hear the chimes <laughs> whenever, whenever some of the grass changes underneath, either it grows back or, or, a, or a sheep eats it. We hear those, hear those chimes. There you go. <laughs> Sounds awesome. So yeah, and we're getting all the, all the goods are coming in, we're getting all the, the, uh, all the, all the, uh, all the wool coming in, all nicely sorted. So that is great. Going to make it nice and easy. Now I've also added, you can see there the minecart going over the, over the top. That is to refill uh, the shears. So let's have a quick look up there. You've seen how the, uh, how the sheep work themselves. This is pretty straightforward. Just got a bunch of chests filled with shears, <laughs> pretty much. And then the minecart will come back under here. And we just got this observer looking at a daylight sensor. So whenever we get a new reading from the daylight sensor, it will trigger this, and so the minecart will go off um, a few times a day just to top up any uh, any sheep that need the extra shears. So yeah, that's it really. Pretty much, uh, pretty straightforward. And uh, yeah, what I do need to do still, I've got a lot of chests over there that've got all the other wool from before, so I've got to move those over here and get them into the into the right uh, into the right uh, chests, which we'll do a bit later on. But next, I want to work on the barn itself, get that in place because I think uh, it probably is quite. Quite cool. She's uh, she saw it in a creative world. Uh, she looked at it on stream, and uh, I think she liked it. So, so I think we'll probably leave the the outsides of her to do. She can do a bit of landscaping here, that kind of thing. But for for, for now, I think we'll get on with the build itself. And with that, the barn is complete. And I think it looks, it looks pretty good. Not too bad, huh? So we've, uh, I've tried to keep the same kind of uh, style, or yeah, same color palette at least that Poppy had before with the red, and then obviously you said some oak and whatnot in there as well. I tried to keep that so it's, uh, you know, it's not a totally different barn. I mean, it's finished <laughs> at least, but yeah, not too bad. So I've got some windows on the side just to kind of break up the, the sides, try to have uh, some different uh, some different colours in the in the roof and some some uh, some variations, so it's not not all stairs and stuff like that. You know, got a mixture of blocks as well to give you a bit more a bit more interest. And then around the back, look around here. here we've got a little opening in there with some with some hay bales, that kind of thing. And we've got something similar around the, around the front. So obviously on this side as well, looks the same. So if we scoot around here, you can see at the front we've got uh, another opening at the top there, and that's how you get in 
to uh, to get access to the shears. So I've got a little mezzanine up there. Got some hay bales in here. Obviously, all the sheep are in here. A mixture of uh, coarse dirt and dirt in the floor here, and we've got these stairs, or these these ladders, should I say? So they come up all the way up to this mezzanine, and then here is how you get easy access to uh, to our storage here for the shears. Just here with uh, uh, you know crafting bench and and our ender chest, just in case. So we get nice easy access, and this is still still totally filled up. So yeah, and over here we can obviously look over, see the sheep and whatnot, and then take off. I say take off, <laughs> try and take off without taking damage. But anyway, let's go back to the city because we have a mystery to solve. And I think it's about time we, uh, yeah, took a close look, close look at the city, maybe have a recap of how this thing was built and see what secrets it has in store for us. Several months ago, construction began on Quantum Reef City. As buildings formed, many questioned the size and placement. But every block was placed with precision. We now know the withering energy controlled our every move in a bid to extend their power. The city forms a pattern unnoticed by most. From the start, the code of the city was its true purpose. What would happen when this code is discovered? The House of the Withers would reveal itself, offering those that cracked the code additional powers in this world. It would not be easy. As with many things in life, a certain perspective is required. Only those that are worthy will crack the code and recognize the pattern. The legates are now powerless to stop us. It is time for the Quantum Reef Code to become apparent. Good luck, my legion. Soon, this world will be ours. 